morning good afternoon good evening hello there my friends this is kevin lopez here from personal tutors bringing to you the chapter from 6th standard in crt book that is a pact with the sun the chapter's name is the friendly mongoose it is an excerpt of a story from the famous book the collection of stories known as panchatantra my friends panchatantra here is a book containing stories with some morals to the left here is the information button if you click at it you'll be directed to the playlist that will lead you to other chapters of the book that is a pact with the sun now coming to the story here there once lived a farmer with his wife and a cute child now the farmer thought that let's have a companion let's ha we should have a pet let's have a pet for our baby for when he grows up he would have a companion to be with since the baby was alone he had no brother and sister the mother liked the idea of the baby getting a companion and agreed thus in the evening the farmer brought in a baby mongoose to his home a little cute furry creature the lady wasn't a bit agreeable with the fact she was a bit reluctant and said that one day he would grow up into a wild creature but the farmer said that it would be a pretty creature or pretty pet to be with six months passed the baby mongoose had grown up now with his twinkling black eyes and furry long tail while the baby was still a cute little one sleeping in a cradle at the house but the mongoose cared about the baby thus one day the lady had to go out to buy some groceries and informed the farmer that although i have to go out to buy the certain groceries i don't like the idea of leaving the baby with the mongoose since he may hurt the baby the farmer disagreed with it and said the mongoose is a friendly creature they both have grown together thus he would be friendlier with the baby and there's nothing to worry about the lady picked up a basket went to the market the farmer here was staying at home since he had nothing to do S sought to go ahead and have a view at the field of his and on the way he met a few friends and could not return home early and took some time on the other hand when the lady returned home her basket filled with groceries and all stuff it was customary for the mongoose to reach out for the family members once they reached home the mongoose happily ran out towards the lady only to give a view of a lady to the lady of blood smeared in his mouth and his claws the lady immediately shrieked out you have killed my baby you bad creature and out of the rage she just threw the basket over the mongoose and crushed it and ran inside to check out for the baby once she ran inside she saw the baby fast asleep safe and sound but there lay a large black snake below smeared in blood and dead immediately the lady realized that she had committed a mistake now my, my friends here the mistake that she had committed was she thought that the mongoose had killed the baby and the blood smeared on his mouth and his claws was of the babies she did not give it a thought that the mongoose would have killed the snake and saved the baby instead thus she ran back to check out the whereabouts of the mongoose who lay there smeared in blood still and the lady just moved him and he was dead unaware the lady repented cried and once she heard her own baby boy cry wiped out her tears and went to feed him now this story my friends in panchatantra gives us a moral that haste makes waste you should always think about anything before you try to attempt it you should think about the consequences the results the outcomes 
and thus you get an idea of what your action would lead to. Let's have a look at the question and answers. Why did the farmer bring a baby mongoose into the house? Now the farmer thought that his child would need a companion when he grows up and it's good to have a pet. Thus he brought the baby mongoose to the house. Why didn't the farmer's wife want to leave the baby alone with the mongoose? Well, the farmer's wife knew that the mongoose was fully grown and is a wild animal. Thus she was a bit reluctant to leave the little baby with a full grown mongoose. What was the farmer's comment on his wife's fears? Well, the farmer replied by saying that the mongoose is a friendly animal and he would not, certainly not hurt the baby because they both have grown up together. Why did the farmer's wife strike the mongoose with her basket? The farmer's wife immediately thought that she, the baby mongoose, had killed the baby and the blood on his claws and his face was all of the baby. She did not give a thought that it would have been certain other creature as a snake or anything else. She simply went ahead and took a hasty action. The last question is, did she repent her hasty action? How does she show her, repent, uh, show her repentance? Yes, my friends, she repented. She repented by crying over the body of the mongoose, feeling him still and dead, shedding her tears, and thus the repent of her could be seen. Although it was a futile attempt because it was just a repent, kind of atonement, my friends. To the right here, you have the link that would lead you directly to the playlist of this book and other chapters. If you have any questions, although I don't think there would be more, or suggestions, do comment below. Subscribe to our channel. We would be glad to offer you more, my friends. Thanking you very much.